Hey, what's going on guys? In this video, we're gonna to talk to you guys about the best balance transfer credit cards in June, 2023. Let's go straight into it. The very first card is gonna be the City Simplicity credit card. Now this particular credit card is best for 0% intro APR and also has low fees as well. Um, the estimated balance transfer savings is around $444. This savings is over 24 months based on a balance transfer, transfer of about $2,500 at a current APR of about 15%, all right? Either way, you're gonna be able to get 0% intro balance transfer and they're gonna give you that, guys, for 21 months. City Citibank has always been known for giving a long amount of time in order for people to uh, have their balance transfers, uh, it, no interest rate at 0%. So that's an amazing uh, way to start there. Also, their regular balance transfer APR after that 21 months is up is going to be 18.99%. That's the low end. And then the high end is going to be as high as 29.74%. Looks like you only need about a 670 credit score to get approved for this card. Again, no guarantee but that's the type of score you need to be around, okay? The next card is going to be the Discover It Balance Transfer card, okay? Now, this one has an estimated savings of about $356 um, using those same numbers, $2,500 balance at a 15% rate. So again, if you're around 15% or so, automatically you're gonna be saving this amount of money, okay? Now, don't forget about that 3% fee. Most credit card uh, companies, when you're transferring a balance over, they're going to have you guys pay that 3%, so keep an eye on that, okay? Uh, but this one's gonna give you an intro balance transfer for uh, 0% and then they're going to give you that for 18 months so a little bit less than the city simplicity card this one has a better overall APR though this one's going to give you 16.99% on the low end and then 27.99 on the high end looks like you need about a 670 credit score to get approved for this card and again that is the discover it balance transfer card okay next is going to be the Wells Fargo Reflect card. Now, this one is going to give you about an average of $444, sorry, $445 uh, savings um, a, as compared to, um, you know, the other cards. Now, this was going to give you 0% for 21 months, and they're saying that it's from account opening, okay? Now, again, some credit card uh, companies are going to you know, start that, um, that time, that clock, as soon as you get approved for the credit card, that's when you need to um, go ahead and uh, make a balance transfer. Now, some credit card companies don't start that clock until you actually make the balance transfer, okay? Wells Fargo says, listen, as soon as you get this card, you need to, tra you need to transfer that balance ASAP, okay? And then again, you get 0% APR for 21 months on account opening on qualifying balance transfers. Make sure you guys read the terms and conditions to find out what those uh, qualifying balance transfers are. Typically, they're going to let you, uh, you know, transfer any uh, balance uh, from another credit card company. Now, keep in mind, uh, most of the time, most companies do not want you guys or will not allow you guys to, tra to transfer a balance if it's from the same credit card company. So, for example, if it's a Wells Fargo credit card, and you have another balance on another Wells Fargo credit card, nine times out of 10, they're probably not gonna let you transfer that balance because as a company, they will be losing money. You guys gotta look at it. Like banks are looking to steal business uh, from other companies, okay? And so that's the whole point of you no know, transferring your balance. But if you are transferring a balance from a, you know, from the same exact company, uh, you know, they're not gonna let you do that in most cases, okay? Same thing goes with um, companies like if you have an auto loan and you may want to try to get an auto loan refinance and you're like, well, man, they wouldn't let me do it. Well, that's why, because they'd rather have you at a higher interest rate, um, you know, instead of just saying, hey, such and such, we you know we found a way to get you a lower rate so we can make less money. They're not going to put themselves in position to make less money. They want new clients. OK, guys, um, the regular balance transfer APR is going to be 17.99 percent and then as high as 29.99 percent. And it looks like you only need about a 670 credit score to get approved for this card. And this card, again, is the Wells Fargo Reflect card, okay? Next is going to be the Citibank Diamond Preferred card, okay? Now, this one is the best go-to for balance transfers in general. Um, so far, this has the highest savings as well, $448 um, if you were looking at, again, 24 months at $2,500 at a current APR, uh, APR 15%, okay? Then, um, now, this is going to give you an intro balance uh, transfer APR for uh, 0%. 
Then you're going to have the uh, the intro balance transfer period for 21 months. So again, here's Citibank again, giving you 21 months. The regular balance APR after that is going to be 17.99 on the low end. And then on the high end, it's going to be 28.74. Looks like you only need a 670 credit score to get approved for this. And this card is the City Diamond Preferred card, okay? Next is going to be the City Double Cash card. Now, this one is best for versatile rewards. If you're looking to get rewards as well as uh, taking advantage of a balance transfer in general, okay? Now, this is going to have an average savings of about, oh, sorry, I don't move the whole screen over. But this is going to have um, a, an average savings of about $344, um, and that's over 24 months based on a balance transfer of about $2,500 at a current APR of 15%. So make sure you guys are paying attention to that. 0% balance transfer as soon as you start out for 18 months, a little bit less than what they're normally doing, okay? And then this one's going to give you 18.99% on the low end, 28.99 on the high end, and then, of course, you're going to be able to have a 670 credit score. Um, you know, just, again, this is what you need in order to increase your chances of getting an approval. There's no guarantee of an approval on this, guys, and that's going to be the city double cash card. Next is going to be the best for everyday spending, and that's going to be the Bank of America Customized Cash Rewards Credit Card. Now, this one's going to have an average savings of about $408, and the reason being is because it's giving you 0% APR for 18 billing cycles. Now, again, you see how they use different words and <laughs> you got to make sure it makes sense to you guys, okay? So this is going to be 0% APR for 18 billing cycles. Let's just say 18 months. But again, billing cycles are sometimes shorter than months. And on any balance transfers made in the first 60 days. So what they're saying is, is that you can only do this as soon as you, not as soon as you get the card, but they're going to give you a 60 day window to go ahead and transfer that balance. Okay. So you most definitely want to go ahead and be ready uh, for that. Some credit card companies want you to transfer the balance from the other company as on, like as soon as you're filling out the application or day one, they do ask credit card companies that allow you to transfer a balance. They do ask, do you have a balance to transfer? So that may be your opportunity there, okay? And the regular APR for this one's going to be 17.99%. That's going to be on the low end. On the high end, you're going to be at around about 27.99%. And then it looks like you need about a 670 credit score to get approved for this particular credit card. And this, again, is the Bank of America Customized Cash Rewards credit card. Next is going to be the Wells Fargo Active Cash Card, okay? Now, this one's going to have a little bit. This is actually one of the lowest savings that we've seen. We're starting to get into that lower savings ranges. And you guys can see, this isn't just some random list, guys. I try my best to make sure that these are categorized and, again, based on perks, rewards, things of that sort, okay? So now... Wells Fargo Active Cash Card. Now, this one's going to be estimated balance transfer savings going to be $212, okay? And that's because they're giving you 0% for 15 months. Um, and then, of course, uh, that lasts, uh, like we said, for 15 months. After that, it's going to be 19.99% on the low end, 24%. Um, or 29.99 on the high end. Looks like you need about a 670 credit score to go ahead and get this card, okay? And again, that's the Wells Fargo Active Cash Card. Next is going to be the City Custom Cash Card. Now, this one is best for automatically maximizing your rewards, okay? Now, this one's gonna give you, again, on the lower end, $225 savings, um, intro balance transfer, APR 0%. That's going to be like that for 15 months. And then on the low end, it's going to be 18.99 on the APR side, and then as high as 28.99. Looks like you need about a 670 or so to go ahead and get qualified for this particular credit card. And again, that is the City Custom Cash Card. Next is going to be the best for preferred rewards members. This one's going to be the Bank of America Unlimited Cash Rewards credit card, okay? Um, and you're going to be able to get 0% APR. That time frame is going to be 18 months, okay? But you know how Bank of America does it. They're giving you 60 days to make those balance transfers. And as you guys can see here, they do have a 3% fee. Most credit card companies are going to charge you that 3% fee, whether you see that or not. But most of them are going to have it in their terms and conditions. Okay, guys, on the low end, the APR on this is going to be 17.99 on the high end, 27.99 percent. 
And then looks like you need about a 670 credit score to qualify for this particular credit card. And again, this is the Bank of America Unlimited Cash Rewards credit card. Next is going to be the Bank of America card. This last one, guys. And so this one's going to be the best for low interest overall. This one's going to have the largest savings we've seen. OK, but why is this card at the bottom? Well, because, again, everyone's situation is going to be a little bit different. And Bank of America is a bigger brand and things of that sort. So you just never know. Everyone's situation is different. But Bank of America, they're not really always known for, you know, people bragging on credit cards and things of that sort. It's straight to the point. It's straight to the money. OK. And they know what you want. So they're going to give you zero percent APR, uh, intro APR for 21 billing cycles. So now we're matching those same numbers as we saw with Citibank. OK. And again, that's for 21 months and you got to make your balance transfers within 60 days at 3% fee is going to apply. On the low end, your interest rate is going to be 15.99%. On the high end, 25.99%. And then it looks like you need about a 670 to go ahead and then qualify for this card. Okay. So good luck to you guys um, applying for whatever credit card you like best. Um, if you guys got any questions about any of this stuff, I'll be, you know, of course, watching the comments. And then also too, guys, make sure you guys check out our free webinar uh, this Friday as we're going to be talking about how you can go into improving your credit score and qualifying for homeownership if you guys are interested in going into homeownership. But it's going to be a free webinar this Friday. And here's the thing. Even if you guys missed the free webinar, don't worry. I'm going to record it so you guys will be able to watch the recording as well. And I may have the recording up there um, a little bit later as well too, but stay tuned uh, for that as well. Okay, guys? But either way, any of these cards you guys can apply for, you, you guys probably saw a reminder down at the bottom inside the uh, you know uh, the description below uh, but again the links to these credit cards is going to be at the in the description below and hopefully you guys got everything you need in this video okay if you if you want to like this video like it if you want to share it share it and as always be sure to subscribe as we had nothing but great content well on the way thank you guys so much and we'll see you guys on the next video